to Raider News. I'm your host for today, Quinn Williamson. We have got a loaded show. But first, today is Monday, October 19th, 2020. It's also a B day. For today's announcements, we send it over to Nick to SAG will meet this Wednesday at 2.30 p.m. Please email Mr. Ketzner if you are interested in attending. Attention all students. The Cumin Yearbook is also on sale for the low, low price of $85 with your free icons. This is the cheapest the yearbook will ever be, and the special pricing ends October 23rd. So far, this has been an unforgettable school year. Don't miss out on the chance to purchase this very special edition. Go to www.justin.com today. Wow, thank you so much for that. Next up, Sean Lee is going to tell us all about Violence Prevention Awareness Week. Go ahead, Sean. Good morning. Today begins the annual statewide week of Violence Prevention Awareness. Please take this week to reflect on how you can be part of the solution. Stop the spread of negativity on social media, face-to-face, -face, and behind people's backs. Remember, change starts with you. Next up, Mike DePaul tells us who won this year's student counselor ups voted on by you guys. Mike? Good afternoon. The votes are in, and here are your student council representatives. For the class of 2021, the president is Ryan Wall, the vice president is Josh Fox, the secretary is Charlie Coolidge, and the treasurer is Connor Feeney. For the class of 2022, the president is Isaiah Net Nathaniel, vice president is Sandro Frias, the secretary is TJ Baylock, the treasurer is Ben Cohen. For the class of 2023, the president is Gabby Smulewitz, the vice president is Daniel Most, the secretary is Jordana Reisberg, the treasurer is Ava Bellato, and for the class of 2024, the president is Kyle Karazak, vice president is Gabriella Rayo, secretary is Lauren Flexstein, and the treasurer is Jaden Reynolds. Congratulations to all the representatives, and good luck in the 2020 to 2021 school year. To close off today's show, Raider Nation leader Lucas Mackey is going to break down the girls' soccer game for us from their big win the other day. All you, Lucas. Yeah, what's up, Raiders? Back at it again with another sports review. Today we got Scotch Plains versus Westfield. Girls soccer. The Raiders rock the white tarps as they take on Westfield. I will tell you, buckle your seats, ladies and gentlemen, because this is going to be a doozy. The Raiders come out of the gate hot as senior Jamie Valiant absolutely plows the defender to create a corner kick opportunity for the Raiders. We are all aware the Raiders are not afraid to get physical. But folks... Viewer discretion advised here because we're about to witness roadkill. Ready? Ready? Boom! Oh, yeah. All ball. I disagree with the call, but I think it's all ball. The Raiders are down to the dying minutes as Lily Camacho splits the seam with a dandy through ball to Corinne Lightning McQueen where she lays it off to Alexa Fazio who absolutely tap twos this ball. Bang! Goalie had no chance. Top bins. Raiders are up 1-0 with three minutes left. That's all she wrote, folks. The Raiders improved to 4-0 and stayed dancing on top of the New Jersey soccer landscape. Alexa Fazio's out-of-the-box screamer proves to be the difference as the Raiders win 1-0 and put the L back in Westfield. Well, guys, thanks for watching today's episode of Raider News. Hope you enjoyed and have a great Monday.